Gamification in the end is what we do uh, at Gamify now. We use game mechanics uh, that we have from our entertainment games that we have been using for all the years in all the different entertainment games that we have been working with. And we use those game mechanics to achieve something in the business world, meaning that we can either attract customers, meaning that we can either uh, help your employees sell stuff, that we can um, educate your employees, stuff like that. It's always quite easy. We try to catch people um, when they have fun while doing something, and then we use that fun activi activity for something that actually helps you in your business. Can we say that marketing is changing thanks to gamification? I would say um, it's one of the big drivers there. Um, one very big part in marketing in the last few years is content marketing. And this has already been happening with a few different types of games where people use the content to create a hype around it and then sell products that are attached to that hype. So yes, games and interaction are definitely changing the way marketing is done since we see also that TV advertising is going down. If you um, sell big uh, posters, that's, that's not gonna attract people anymore and bring people to your store. If you have interaction and if you approach people where they are mostly on mobile within a game that is fun for them, they will come on their own. It's an intrinsic motivator for them to come. And how is it possible to gamify the outdoor business? Um, we have already seen big examples on that. There is something like a Runtastic that does the story running. There is something like a Zombies Run. What do those people do? They create a great game that helps people to connect with their mobile device and connect with the brand, and then they create an event around it. And the event gives you guys, the store owners, the opportunity to interact with the target audience that you wanna sell your product to. So you can get them in your store, you can talk to them on all the social platforms, Facebook, WhatsApp groups, you can do Snapchat with them, you can do all the different things that are there, and you can sponsor those events and get your brand out there. So those are the big options um, for the back door, and then there is obviously the front version, where you can actually come up with your own game. If you wanna produce your own game, there are also different versions of that. Um, and it really depends on what you want to achieve, but there, there are a ton of different opportunities also for the outdoor world. There, there have been great videos in the last few days. Have you seen the climbing activity? There was like a wall, like, like a rock climbing wall, and they had, with a projector, they projected like butterflies on it, so you had to touch them with your hands. Um, I don't think that it's possible with every activity and everything, because you don't even need to do it if the activity is fun on its own, but there are great, opportunities out there and there are great examples for outdoor activity that actually especially attract the younger yeah. audience that most of the guys need to have in their stores as well since they're like right that's that's their pain point for a lot of them.